Alright. Okay. Hey guys, it's me, Dragon Zero. I'm back in again. I'm acting to the finale of Miss Marvel, so. Let's just get this shit over with. So it looks like Carol Danvers shows up. Music sounds like don't stop me. You really don't stop me.
Uh oh, she's about to get her costume. Spider Man. Oh no. Okay, some of that CGI looks weird. <clears throat> Damn. <clears throat> Uh -huh. 
I kind of hope Daredevil shows up. The costume looks kind of nice, though. Wonder who they're gonna get. Why damage control the villain in here? Or like a second antagonist or whatever. <laughs> it's just literally just tapping it.
Damn. You gonna betray him? I knew it. Or Moto Hoopo. Uh oh. Yeah, <laughs> come on. Walking in like badasses. Uh oh. Uh-uh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn. Oh, devil toothpaste. Damn, that's they'll be dead if they if that actually exploded on them. So devil toothpaste is like three hundred degrees. So they'll definitely be getting like third degree burns.
Uh oh, love interest. <laughs> you gonna <laughs> damn you just got hit damn <laughs> Damn, he just got nailed. Uh-oh. Damn. Ooh, damn. Nailed. Please, I, I really hope they get Matt Murdock to show up at the lawyer who's going to free him. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh oh, he's counting evil. Huh. 
<laughs> no! Uh oh. What's that? Oh shit, it is Captain Marvel or... Damn. Oh shit, you're gonna get the little fist. You get the fist. <laughs> Hammers. Damn, she just did a fucking Hulk smash. Yes. Uh oh. Uh oh. <coughs> 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 Damn. <clears throat> uh oh. Hey. Uh-uh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, he's fully evil now. Damn. Gonna touch her nose. Damn, she just she just started a um, avatar so I don't really feel anything for this little You chose you, you were the chosen one. I'm really mad.
Damn. Damn. Yeah, they're going to have to fight a really good lawyer. Hopefully, we'll get to see him, you know. Jay. Yeah, they're just friends out of a sudden. Uh-oh. Look behind her. Would have been really cool if she actually got into the costume she had when she was 15. Now that would be really cool. Uh-huh. Uh-uh. Where is he? 
Oh shit, hey. Uh oh. You joined the good guys. Miss Marvel. <laughs> <laughs> That's how she got the name <laughs> in the universe. Well, I do like the actress, Sarah. She seems like very, like you seem to end the know with the MC or, or the comic voice in Venator, which I respect a lot. <laughs> oh, yep, from the comic book, comic book nun. Behind you, Kamala. Behind you, she's behind you. Behind you. And one week later, oh shit. Who are we gonna see? We gotta see a cameo. I know we see Carol Danvers, but. Damn. Uh -uh. <gasps> Mutants! 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 The mutants! X-Men, let's fucking go. Welcome to the MCU. Oh, shit. Get the fuck out of here. All right, you're blocked. Yeah, Adam Pachiti, you're a shitty person. You need to leave me a little back alone. Yeah, Adam Pachiti, leave me the fuck alone. Piece of shit. Okay, we're gonna fucking block your ass. So.
All right, gonna. But yeah, I can't believe um, <clears throat> I can't believe we were getting an, a confirmation on mutants, aka the X Men and stuff. Cheeky bastard. <laughs> Oh, okay. Time for an MCU uh, after credits. Oh, no, never mind. Oh. Okay. It's got to block a motherfucker. Okay. Uh-oh. Here we go. <gasps> oh, shit. Yes! Yes! Here we go. Did he just transform? Oh, shit. <laughs> Cheeky bastards. Miss Marvel, okay. Or in the uh, Marvels. Yep, yeah, gonna block this motherfucker, so. Do I gotta block him? Ban his ass, too. But yeah, after watching this, um, this was pretty good. I actually enjoyed this quite a lot. I do want to see, I, uh, oh, actually no. The last episode kind of got a little bit um confused, like not confusing, but just kind of rushed. You know what I mean? I feel like there should have been a little bit more, you know. I, I, I don't know. I feel like it's for kids, I know. But even then, this is, like, it's for families and shit. Like, they should have done something more. I do hope that we get to see a PG-13 version of Miss Marvel eventually, you know. Like, build up to it. I was also kind of hoping that, um... What's his name? Um, uh, Matt Murdock show up as the lawyer, you know, who's going to help him out, you know, just so that they can get screwed over. Um, but overall, I do, I did enjoy some of the actors. They're actually pretty decent, you know. Like, I, I don't know if some of these actors were, like, popular in Pakistan or wherever the fuck they're from. So, you know, it's, like, it's cool seeing them getting their American debut. Or if they're just, they've are just they been in them stuff before, then, you know, making their appearance in the MCU. So, it's cool. You know, I do want to see, um, uh, yeah. And I just got to say, fucking Adam Pacitti, he fucking annoys the shit out of me. He doesn't know what the fuck so what. He doesn't know what the me word um leave me the fuck alone means. He's too retarded. Like he has like a like a ten i ten percent IQ or whatever the fuck it is. Like he can't even fucking like think straight. He can't even say shit properly. Motherfucker from England and yeah, he's a fucking liar. So yeah. Um but anyway, um overall I'd probably give this about a team. The series around maybe a 6.57, but, you know, it's for kids, so, you know, it's probably a 7.5, but they, I do want to see more mature, like, they gotta, like, you know, expand a lot of stuff, like, the clandestine didn't really make sense, per se, like, the alternate world that they explained, it's not really there to, like, it's hard there's nothing there to, like, back it up. We don't know what it looks like. Sure, Jewel, but why did it kill all the other clandestines, you know? Or even where they even went, you know? 
that does not make any sense. So I don't know. I just feel like something, something got to be explained. Maybe they'll do a separate clandestine movie. So, um, Miss um the actress who played Miss Kamala, um, Miss Kamala is actually pretty decent. I actually enjoyed her quite a lot for somebody who's like really early in their career. I do hope we get to see little. I, I do want to see her in more projects. I would. I want to see what she can do beside the Marvel project. You know what I mean? So you know, it's like also like hopefully they'll give her something. You know, other studios look into her, like they've been doing with a lot of other people. So you know, like doing other contracts and stuff. Um, I don't remember who else. Um, we also, I want, also want to see some more, like, multiverse stuff, and maybe some more cameos. I, I like these cameos help the show, and I do think we have to see something, you know, but, yeah, this is probably going to be my last movie watch through for a while until, like, um, for, like, for a couple of weeks, maybe, until, like, um, fucking She-Hulk shows up. I might try to get co-host for that, I don't know for sure, I don't even know who anybody who's going to be willing to join me, so, you know, um, yeah, so, yeah, But yeah, overall, I do want to like I I wonder what other um stories they plan to do because right now like I'll admit um for um um what's it called um stage four or whatever the fuck they're doing um is uh, like should be multiverse focus, you know, but I don't know for what they're also going to do. They might even wait for it to see the episode um, five, you know, unless quantum mania is going to change all that, you know, I just want to see multiverse, more multiverse stuff, bring in the fucking dare, Ben Affleck daredevil, bring in fucking Electra from that show, like bring in multiple fucking people. We need to see some more character from Mother Marvel Universe. Hell, bring in David Hasselhoff as fucking um, as Nick Fury. That would be really cool. I want to see him maybe play um, Nick, like Sam Jackson, Nick Fury's dad or some shit like they did in the comics. So, I don't know. I, I want to see something. They got to do like some really cool shit. You know, I want to see them bring in these characters. So. But yeah, overall, as I said, I gotta be giving this a six, uh, uh, like six point five or seven. So overall, in the series, so you know, like I, they do need a like if they do a season two, they gotta have like a main villain, like, like, like have them be the main focus. Cause I will say the villains of this series, they they were all over. They shouldn't like be like that. They should have had just one villain, and that's it. So, I don't know. But yeah, I'm Dragon Zeron. Thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Peace.